in the game, maybe you shouldn't have stayed out that late, third time through the lineup. How, how nice is it to have a manager that can see with his eyes or use the book when he needs to? Uh, I mean, that's really good, you know, when you have the chance to face for third time the lineup. Uh, that's a good sign. Um, What's really good, I think, so locked in that game. You know, we know um, we playing for animation game, and uh, it was so good. So I'm, I'm really, uh, I'm really excited when he gave me the chance to face the lineup for third time. So it was really good, and you know, sometimes we try to show that to the manager to give you that chance to to keep in the game. So that's really important for for starters. Hey, down in front here, Tim. Is tomorrow the biggest start of your career? Yeah, probably. I think, I think at this point, every every game is uh, you know game seven uh, for me and for all my teammates. Uh, you know, we we've been fighting uh, a lot in all those situations, and um, like I say last time, every play, every uh, every game matters a lot. And yeah, um, it's gonna be you know a privilege to get that that chance. Uh, playing in front of um, our fans, you know, I've been well, I've been here, so I don't remember what was the last time <laughs> we'd be around. So, uh, just amazing opportunity, and, and you know, uh, I'm going to do my best. With every game mattering so much, and tomorrow especially so, what strategies do you have to not get nervous? Well, um, you know, the, our approach uh, never changed. You know, um, you know, those are uh, the best, the best effort. We we have a good um, scouting report, good plan um, to to make it tomorrow, and and you know uh, since first inning start to do it right away, you know I took out the sun and 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 do our best. So that's gonna be really important um, every single pitch. Okay, down here on the right, Abby. Was there a point this year where you wondered, am I going to come back from the, you had those couple low points that you had? Was there a point where you wondered, am I going to come back from this, or did you always know that you could just based on your previous history? Well, that's, that's really important right now. Uh, the point we we are, you know, um, if um, if you go back and remember all that uh, good moments you have, I try to bring um, use it to the present and and be just that moment. Um, but for sure, as look, it's gonna be a really exciting and, and cool time. And uh, for me, I just wanna enjoy. It, you know, I've been I've been in this situation uh, before, and I just wanna keep keep playing. And, and like I said before, it's a privilege to get the ball. You know, so too many starters get want to get this opportunity, and and you know, it's a privilege for me to to get it. So um, I'm so excited for that. What would you say the biggest adjustments that you made this year have been? Uh, the biggest adjustments, uh, you know, control control accounts, but more than that, I make a couple of adjustments in my mechanic. Um, one of those, get my angle a little bit up, you know, it give me more chance to all the pitches go in the same tunnel. So uh, that was the biggest uh, adjustments um, I did during the season, you know, give me more consistency in the sum. And, you know, and for sure better results, um, you know, every every time I throw the ball. So. Um, uh, that was a good adjustment. Okay, far left, Howie. Jose, between recently becoming a citizen and getting your 100th win, which I know you were proud of as the first Colombian, and now pitching in games of this magnitude, is this a unique year in your life, never mind your career? Is this a year you'll look back on down the road and embrace it in a special way? Yeah, for sure. Um, it's... Um, there's a lot of things, you know, at the same time, so, um, um, a lot of effort, but for sure, uh, being the postseason and get the opportunity to get 100 wins uh, means a lot for me, means all my efforts, you know, um, are going the right, in the right direction. Um, but honestly, I want to win, you know, I want to get opportunity to be in the World Series, to to fight for something big, and and we are the opportunity in front of us. So um, for me, all my teammates, this uh, this this matter a lot, and you know we we keep fighting and you know do whatever we need to do to win. Okay, far left in the back. Lelo. En esta larga gira de 15 días, a veces te has pasado y has tenido que sacrificar porque pasan siete, ocho 
y hasta nueve días y no lanzas. Entonces, esto, tú como pitcher veterano, ¿cómo te enfocas? ¿Cómo puedes trabajar tu pensamiento táctico? Que sabemos que es uno de los pensamientos tácticos más positivos que tiene el equipo en el estado de lanzadores. Bueno, sí, ha sido eh, un, un largo tiempo para nosotros sin, sin volver a la casa. Eh, sabemos que, que la única manera de volver era con la clasificación y pues gracias a Dios lo pudimos conseguir. Ha sido muy importante. En situaciones cuando tengo muchos días sin, sin lanzar, sigo haciendo la, la misma preparación. A veces me toca lanzar más de, de un bullpen y, y pues ya me he encontrado en esta situación en, en algunos momentos en, en mi carrera y, y pues eh, yo creo que es un poco más la mente que, que juega un papel importante. Para, para prepararnos y para seguir en, 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 la misma, en, en las mismas condiciones que uno quiere cuando tenga la oportunidad de lanzar eh, eh, la pelota. Pero eh, en esta instancia hay mucha energía, tú sabes, la mente se hace más fuerte y, y siempre lo, lo que pasa por, por tu mente es ganar, así que, que no importa cuántos días tengas sin pichar, el día que sales eh, es un día muy valioso. José, República Dominicana ha tenido más de 900 peloteros en grandes ligas. Tiene un solo lanzador surdo con 100 o más victorias. Colombia, 33 peloteros en grandes ligas. Y tú tienes 100 victorias como lanzador surdo. ¿Qué tan especial, comparativamente hablando, para ti es eso? Sabiendo que usted de Colombia no es un país amante del de béisbol per se como deporte número uno. Y saber que países como nosotros y como Venezuela están a la par contigo en calidad, victorias y en estelaridad en grandes ligas. Oh, wow, ese es tremendo dato. Eh, eh, me hace sentirme muy orgulloso. De verdad que, que ha valido mucho eh, la pena todo el sacrificio que, que he hecho en, en mi carrera. Eh, sabes, muy agradecido con todas las personas que, que han aportado ese granito de arena en mi carrera. Y pues llegar hasta esta instancia de, de más de 100 victorias, eh, volver a una postemporada. Tú sabes, eh, si miras hacia atrás te das cuenta de que todo el esfuerzo pues, pues ha sido, ha sido muy, muy valioso y, y pues estar en esa lista que, que tú me estás diciendo para mí eh, vale mucho, sabiendo que, que por parte dominicana con, con tantos lanzadores zurdos, eh, muchos de ellos van a llegar a esa victoria y para nosotros en Colombia no tenemos tantos y, y llegar a ese número es muy importante, más que, más que agradecido y pues seguir luchando por... Tú sabes, el cielo es límite y seguimos peleando, seguimos, como te digo, eh, buscando la manera de, de llegar a, a la Serie Mundial y, y ganarla. Eso, eso es lo que, lo que más vale para nosotros ahora. Okay, we'll take one more over here from the far right. Hi, um, you, you faced the Phillies in the playoffs two years ago uh, with St. Louis, and you know you, you pitched well, but they ended up coming back and it kind of kick-started their, their playoff run that year. What do you remember about that start? Um, and is that something you keep in mind and, and can maybe take some lessons from as, as you face them uh, tomorrow, especially with having a lot of returning members of that lineup? I remember, yeah, I remember for sure the, the start uh, in San Luis. Um, it was a great game. And they have a almost similar lineup, uh, I remember, than in last time. And they, they are pretty good, you know. Um, um, I have um, I've faced this, these guys a lot and, and for sure always uh, you know, a challenge, and and it's really good. You know, this is part of the uh, the postseason. Every everything you're gonna face, uh, I think, is uh, gonna be a really good team. And and you know, we have really good rivalry, so so that's uh, that's that's important for for us and means a lot. And, and you know, uh, I'm I'm thinking a lot of me and getting my credits and you know uh, the way I want to pitch to them. But yeah, for sure, it's gonna be a special game. Uh, really good again to to face them in the postseason when you know it's, if you see they they always play for for a postseason so they are really good so okay. thank you Jose appreciate it.